Top story, bottom of the hour, Austin's police chief responding to allegations of corruption at the city's DNA lab. Yeah, the investigation follows a 22-page complaint filed in February by a former DNA analyst at that lab. With new developments, our Chris Sadi joins us from the Austin Police Department where, Chris, you just stepped out of a press conference with the chief. What do you say? Well, Sally, the police department, the police chief, the district attorney's office say that over the years they've taken several looks at the crime lab just to make sure everything was being done right and every time it was. But when an allegation like this comes to light, immediately it jeopardizes the integrity of evidence pertaining to years of court cases. So they are acting quickly, providing documents and findings to the Texas Forensic Science Commission. An outside auditor will be brought in to review the complaint and the internal investigations. Chief Art Acevedo says they've always taken steps to make sure DNA testing is done correctly, including 11 different audits, some of them FBI audits, since 2004. It remains to be seen how all of this could impact court cases where the question DNA testing was evidence, but DA Rosemary Lemberg says when allegations are made, they have a legal and ethical obligation to be completely transparent. So we're going to do everything we can to locate every defense attorney who would have anything to do with a present or past case that could have involved um, laboratory work that is implicated by these allegations. And both the DA and the police chief say they are completely confident in the DNA lab that they investigated Miss Hamilton's allegations earlier on in the year and they were found to be untrue. We're live downtown. Chris Sadegi, KXAN, Austin News.